What is up, boys and girls? It's your boy Peter in his work clothes, bringing you another episode of Talking with Peter. Hell yeah. How y'all doing today? And it is such a beautiful day out, literally. It, it was, it's cool out, but it's actually looking very nice. Um, yes, as you can see, I'm in my work clothes. I just got home from work, um, but right now, um, big, big night, because tonight I am going to pick up Grand Theft Auto 4 late at night because the person who I bought it from uh, works till late and I figured you know what I'm going to meet him at the place so I can get the game and I'm just so pumped I've been reading the reviews how critically acclaimed this game is and just all of the tens that this game got and it makes me very interested in playing and really giving it a shot so just got home now, gonna get ready, um, might film a review. For those wondering, this is actually uh, how I film uh, my review. Um, I'm actually working on a double feature review of uh, Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories. Um, get that there. This is just my Easter stuff. Had my own Easter, had my Easter recently because I'm Greek, but that's, uh, I started filming uh, for uh, Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories and Grand Theft Auto Vice City Stories. I was supposed to have it done before the before I went and picked up this game, but time kind of got in the way and work has been crazy. So we're going to do it tonight. I'm going to get the game. Really, really pumped for it. I, you know, I keep saying that, but considering what I've seen of it and considering I even got the sticker right there of it, I'm just so pumped to try it. And just as you guys know, I love the GTA games and just what they're bringing to this one really excites me so right now I'm just getting ready to go um, gonna talk to you guys in a little bit and everything So yeah, right now already, and speaking as I said, perfect day for this, um, nice day, w nice weather, it's still a little cool, but it's better than rain, I was worried it was going to rain this day, but other than that, all ready for it, for it, and just really, really, really excited to get going. Um, Still got some time too, just waiting for the phone there to charge. And while I'm at it, um, I actually will show you guys how I actually play my games. And basically, for those wondering how I play my games, uh, if it's PS2, uh, Xbox, my Xbox is going to the shop, that's why it's in there. Or GameCube, or I'm watching VHS tapes, I play it on this thing. But if I'm playing like 360 or PS3, that's a different story. Because let me take you to where I watch my stuff. Here's the door that leads to the movie factory. Hell yeah, boys and girls. Let me get some light on in here. Here we are, boys and girls. This is where I watch my movies and I play my games. Um, got some games right there I've been playing. This has been my go-to game recently. I've been playing the shit out of the multiplayer on this game. This game is so addicting, but I think Grand Theft Auto 4 is going to take that position for a little bit. Still going to play it and everything, but yeah, GTA deserves a lot of time and everything. But here is the room itself. Um, got some posters there and everything. Hostel 2, Therese does. And in here is the stuff. Um, there is my 360 that I play my games on, my PS3, my Blu-ray player, and my AV um, 
HDMI thing, whatever they're called, the AV surround sound system. And there's the U the HDMI cord, long one that goes all the way out here and into the projector that is projected onto the screen. The reason why you see one there, there, and I have another one running across the floor is because I had one before it, but it would flicker like shit when I'm watching something. And that really annoyed me, so I'm just like... So, um, eventually it just gave out and we got a new one and we're running it across the floor. It's insane. But, for those wondering, in here, this is uh, the workout room that we use from time to time. Very cool room. Room. I'm on that Bowflex a lot. And um, here is the weights and a treadmill and more weights. The usual workout room stuff. But for those wondering where I play my games, now you know. So, yeah. All right. Bones at like 80%. I know I can bring the charger with me, but um, I... But I'm just gonna, you know, uh, get it all charged up. I'm still gonna bring the charger with me just in case. But other than that, um, just gonna get it all ready. The all charged up and to the point that it doesn't need to charge anymore. And then we're gonna head out. Also taking these with me. Uh, these are some stuff I'm gonna trade in while out and about. Just some of the stuff I got on DVD and everything. Thing. Um, so, uh, yeah, I got a lot got a lot I plan to do in this video and everything. Some of the locations you might have been to before I actually took you guys to them uh, back over the summer and everything. So, yeah, but all that aside, right now, i uh, going to continue filming uh, the Liberty City stories portion of the video right now while I still got some time. And I'm also, I got a bag in the car with some writing stuff. So, gonna basically um gonna basically write while waiting for the game and right now gonna film me uh a re gonna continuing filming the review of those two gta games so i'll talk to you um i'll talk to you guys in a little bit when we're about to head out all righty we just finished uh the uh Liberty City Stories portion of the uh double feature review or the double game review of of the GTA Stories review, because I'm going to call it that, just to shorten it, and I'll put like Liberty City Stories, Vice City Stories, and San Andreas, and this is actually how I film right here, um, that's actually the camera I use, uh, J5, J5 Create, and there I am right there, hello, and pretty much this is what I talk into when I make these videos, this is, I, I showed an unboxing, this is a Blue Yeti mic and I have it hooked up into there, whenever I want to change it back to um, the, the regular one, just go into there and just type uh, speakers, speakers. Um, I also have my other one, I also have uh, my headphones there but they're hooked into that so I could change it to that but not right now but um, yeah, Yeti mic, and pretty much talk into it, increases the sound and everything, and these are the lights I use when I make these videos. Um, great lights, great to use. If anybody's looking for lights, definitely get these. Um, some dust up there. got to clean this room sometime, but... Yeah, that's pretty much what's to come. Uh, tonight, uh, after uh, I get home and I do an unboxing of that game, I'm going to get... I'm gonna film uh, the rest of the review and get that all finished with and everything. So yeah, definitely a lot to come. So yeah. All right. Um, we're not actually not gonna leave right now. Uh, we're gonna wait till like si till like 6:45 or 7 to head out because um, we figured what are we gonna be doing for seven hours? That's like the craziest thing. So yeah. Still counting down, still getting the thing charged, I'm still getting my stuff there, and just wasting the time right now watching some cool duder. Um, this is this day seeing the Forbidden Kingdom. Um, let MJ drink that damn thing. How can you drink that stuff? <laughs> That's insane. But yeah, definitely just um, just getting it out, enjoying the time and everything. I just had a I just had a chocolate bunny because I had to keep myself crazy. I might get something to eat there too. I don't I know I don't usually eat this crazy, but I want to keep awake tonight. And I and I just had Easter. I want to get that dang bunny out of the room.
going back on the scheduled eating next week um, because because I gotta get back into it but yeah so yeah we're just hanging out a bit watching some watching them going to see uh, Forbidden Kingdom and just you know enjoying ourselves where's this oh my god what kind of thing what kind of movie is that no more bats come on that's and you put a black person on it that's racist All right, so we're just hanging out for a bit right now, just waiting for the time to go by. It's, uh, uh, and I'm playing me some uh, Halo 3. Love this game. The other game that broke loads of records that I already reviewed. Just playing some multiplayer. I've been playing this a lot the past like year. This and COD 4 are like my two go-to games. Alrighty, we're getting ready to go right now. Um, it's 6.56, going to get the game, and we are going to have us some fun. Let's get going. I'm going to get my charger ready so I can charge my phone or try not use it so much. So, let's get going. Alright, finally here. Just going to make a quick stop in here, set everything up with that dude because it's dude and everything I won't say his name but um, pretty much also gonna pick up some stuff too I gotta pick up a Bluetooth adapter for my computer so we'll get into that and I'll see you guys out here and maybe make a pre-order so catch, catch you guys in a little bit just want to turn this off so I don't get people going crazy in here so I'll see you in a little bit alright so I found it very good I uh, did find it because I need one of these for my computer so yeah found the first thing I was looking for alrighty finished that all up everything seems to be good got what I was looking for I needed one of these for my computer because mine was like not picking up like those things there so I had to get this and everything wireless blue uh, gets Bluetooth a lot better for on my PC so I've been looking for this because I've been having some trouble with Bluetooth and everything so yeah, definitely great to have this. So, right now, uh, since we have some time, we might check out Bull Moose real quick, or uh, and then we're gonna head to uh, Red Robin get something to eat real quick. Oh, on second thought, I may get something to eat first. So, yeah, let's get something to eat first so before it closes. Let me just let me just check the time first and figure out like what we're gonna do because I'm, I'm trying to get this. Because I'm trying to make sure I go to everything here for the midnight and everything. So let's see what we got. Now, be right. All right. So they both close at nine. So I think what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to get something to eat. Uh, I can do bolmos another time, but yeah, let's get something to eat at Red Robin. I'm gonna get some food there. And also, I'm gonna go to Walmart see if I can get me a see if I can get my mother a Mother's Day gift. So let's get going. Alrighty guys, welcome back here. Anybody remember this place? I came here here over the summer and I, this is one of the places I filmed. Well, we're here to get something to eat because we are getting Red Robin, motherfuckers. <laughs> yep, going to get some Red Robin. That's the burger joints around here. Next to Five Guys. Not Five Guys, but yeah, going to get Red Robin. Let's get going. What is it? Um, April, and yet it's still cold out. Hopefully, it's gonna get warmer as the day goes along. But yeah. But yeah, I said it was warmer earlier. Now it's getting cooler. It feels it's actually very nice. Oh uh, yeah. Lights coming on. Whenever the light comes on, that means it's getting darker. Ooh. I'm gonna walk through Macy's. So that I can get, so that we can get there. Usually, this is how I walk into places when I. Walk. Uh, alrighty. So we're coming, coming out here. I see there's a new comic shop coming. Wow, Little Giants Comics and Collectibles. 
It's actually pretty cool. I don't know what they'll have there. Very cool. Got the original Star Wars poster. Like that. Yeah, that's a special edition of Star Wars posters. So yeah. Yeah, walking around. Wow. <laughs> Got a raptor head there, a T Rex head. And this is Joy Biz Toys. Some of these shops I've never seen before, probably just opened. Going down here. Oh, Red Robin. Yep. So much to choose from on this fucking menu. Art attack. Oh, I never seen this before. One of these I'm definitely gonna try. Probably this one. This is smokehouse brisket burger, brisket chips. So much to choose from. I might try that actually. Fire grilled beef burger topped with whiskey river BBQ sauce. Oh, I'm trying that. Fuck it. Okay. So, yeah. I'm trying that with surprise. <laughs> okay, that's all done with. Just uh, finished eating and then uh, walk around the mall. Or... God, everything's closing. Same right now. And build a bear. <laughs> oh, I know where I'm gonna be tonight. I know where. Yeah. Well, get a picture of those and let me take it to the bathroom. <laughs> Just kidding. Calm yourselves. Very nice day. Very nice night, I should say. Got my wallet. I honestly thought while eating I had lost the wallet. That was just and it got it everything. But yeah, Red Robin has like the best burgers. It was so totally worth it. Ah, oh, freaking Dairy Queen's closed. I check out the GameStop up there, see how they're doing with it. See if they have anybody going to buy GTA 4. Or see if anybody bought it, I should say. Yeah. <coughs> I don't know why I'm talking. Even not the Annie is closed. Wow, that is so weird. Gyros. Yeah, they added some new shops here. I gotta say, they're actually pretty good here. Like those caricatures. Oh, there's a cool shop. Hot topic, but it's closed. So we went in there and got me a shirt or two. Seems like now they got some good ones. Not like the anime stuff. I don't hate anime, but that's what I'm in love with. Oh, there's some people in there. Oh, there's some people. Oh, but actually, this is closed too. Probably not doing anything here with the game. But yeah, not every. But yeah, seems like everything's closed. Let's go check out um, another place. Let's go to the the Target open? I might go check out the Target because I want to get my mom a Mother's Day gift and they got some good stuff there for mothers. Let's uh, check out. Uh, how much time do we have? Eight twenty-two. Three hours left. Four. Three hours left. Three hours and 37 minutes left. Hell yeah. Juicy Penny. This is what it all looks like when it closes, everybody. 
You guys always wonder what a mall looks like when it closes? Do you have your answer? There's no kill bots here. Anybody see Chopping Mall? Well, the, those kill bots will come out and they'll kill you. None of that. Nothing here. Yeah. Let's get going. Yeah, I think I'm gonna head out there. There's not much to do here. FYE open? Let me check if FYE is open. Uh, no, it's not actually. I see the doors closed, so no, it's not open. Do not worry, guys. We are almost out. So. Let's get going. Freedom! You know, I feel so different to be out here on my own. To be with friends or something. Never this late. It's insane. I'm gonna go to uh, Target now. See what they got there. Just start the car. So far, so good right now. Let's get this going. Pretty soon it's gonna be dead here. So, yeah, everything's going great. Turn this down. So, let's go. Alright, here we are back at Target. Been wanting to come here for quite a while, so there it is. Target, we're gonna go in and get my mom a nice Mother's Day gift. So, yeah, you guys see my peace sign right there. So, yeah, let's get going. Alright, so apparently I'm looking through like the Mother's Day, the Mother's Day stuff. There is nothing here. You no, know, thank you. Like, you know, like chocolate boxes, nothing. There's these that you're already focusing on. The 4th of July, when that's just in July. I don't know why they send me doing that for that holiday. It's so weird. I want to get something for, for 4th of July. Not 4th of July. I mean, I want to get something for Mother's Day. <sighs> Man, it's just so weird. Yeah, but nothing much here. No really... Nothing really that makes me want to go and run and get it. No movie that I want to get today and everything. So... Yeah, now this part was a disappointment. And so, yeah. And we only have like three hours left for midnight. So, yeah. Not really much to run home about. So, let's get the fuck out of here. Like even here, like here would be like where the Mother's Day stuff would be, but there's even, not even anything. I don't want to get that big ass dog. <laughs> I'm walking home with that thing. Imagine somebody putting that in the car. I can you take from Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. Day. <laughs> it was a, probably would look retarded, but yeah, nothing. Let's get out. Might have to switch over to my phone at some point, because this thing because the battery on this thing is low and everything so well not low it's just going because I'm recording a lot but yeah I'm gonna try and get what I can so alright so target was a bust I really came out of that I really wish we did so you know can't always be winners so we're gonna move to uh, Walmart and get me some stuff there and we'll see what they got there and then get a good Mother's Day gift there. Ah, dang, it's really getting dark. Keep forgetting how dark it gets around this time. <laughs> so, let's get to Walmart. Well, we're going to spend the next couple hours. Might have to switch over from this camera to another one, but to my phone or whatever, considering the life. But, you know, let's get going. Let's just get going. We can make it through the night. We make a quick stop at uh, Cumberland and it's a good milk stove. I got an extra thick sticker milk stove. So I just need this because I'm going to be driving later and I want to keep the weight and everything. No, 
Anyways, next week I'm going back on the food thing. So, yeah. Let's see how this for real thing is. Remember, I used to have these in college. Here we are. Walmart, baby. Let's get the thing. Let's get it. Alright, we're back to uh, Walmart. I'm gonna take the time now to find my mom a good gift. One that she'll love. You know, it's always the thought that counts. I wanna get her something good, like a box of chocolates or something. Then, something that she'll love. Nothing down here. Anything here? Okay. No, nothing. Nothing here. Oh, sorry. Alright. Let's look in here. See what I could get for my mom for Mother's Day. And these plates here look. My mom does like making your makes those yogurt things in a blender, so so maybe I could get her this. Let me check around a little bit more. All right, so after finding the aisle here, I think I gotta think I know what I'm gonna get. I'm actually gonna get this and uh, one of those. So yes. Alright, so the more I've actually been thinking about it, this cup, these two cups I'm going to go with, but the stuff I got before was actually a, um, was not a, um, it wasn't a jewelry like I thought it was. I thought it was earrings, but they're not. So we're going to get this thing. It says family on it, but I'm going to look, I'm going to come back to this one because it's the one I got my eye on. Um, but then there's also this one right here and pick it up. So we're gonna look around a little bit more and see what we got. Check, checkmate, and or check in hand, which is what Eugene Levy says in Dumb and Dumber. So yeah, got everything you need here, and pretty much, much. Now I'm just gonna use the bathroom, get myself some water. Still got some time because. Could still have almost an hour left, but yeah. Hey I'm, hey, I'm just walking through the place and I see now LL Cool J is literally, literally promoting jewelry now. Guess his head was too much like a shark's fin to continue rapping, so now he's promoting jewelry. <laughs> that's done with the Walmart's closing now. Time to make my way out of here so that we can. So that we can get back there and I drive for a bit back to the Best Buy so I can pick up the game. So, yeah, we're gonna. I'll show you guys it in the car. So, let's get back to it. Hope we can make it back safely. So, let's get going. Let's get out of here. Sheesh, I honestly thought it looked darker. If this was. Sheesh, I honestly thought it'd be darker. Considering my brother hit a tree one time. Sheesh, I honestly thought it'd, uh, it'd be darker considering my brother hit a tree one time and late at night. Night, it's so pitch black, but it's actually not that bad. It looks the same as it always does, so. Yeah, let's get out of here. Whoa. Oh, fuck! That scared the shit out of me! Get back to the car. 
Well, boys and girls, it is finally time. Finally got it. <laughs> After waiting so long, finally got it from this guy. Grand Theft Auto 4. Fuck yes. <sighs> Can't wait to get home and start this tomorrow. This game looks fucking amazing. So, yeah, let's get out of here. Um, sorry, I didn't mean to put you guys down. Um, but, yeah, let's get out of here before some El Salvador dude comes and fucking tries to rape me and takes my money or the game or something. They're even gamers. <laughs> I even got a picture of me holding it up. I'm gonna put it on my phone and I'm gonna put it on Facebook and everything. And so, yeah, let's get out of here. I'm gonna unbox it at home too, so see you guys. Alrighty, back home right now, and here's this beast right here that everybody has been talking about Grand Theft Auto 4, baby finally gonna get to play it after just all the hype getting into it all of everybody just clamoring how great this game is finally gonna be able to play it tomorrow um, gonna do an unboxing of it a little bit cuz I've been wanting to unbox this thing thing but gonna do that um, before I go to bed because I am very tired right now I am just tired it was a crazy day but it was a really great one too and I thank you guys for coming along I had a really great time going to places seeing everything getting the stuff I needed even getting my Mother's Day gift which is in the closet there I'm actually kinda surprised how this battery even lasted for that long but it was really worth it considering considering all of the stuff uh, I went through today but I but I'm but again thank you guys I can't thank you guys enough for watching and sticking through this it was a really great time and tomorrow I'm gonna get this video up and edit it along with my review of Vice City Stories at Saints Row it's just right now I am very tired it was a long long day but it was a very great one too so Thank you guys so much for watching, and be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.